Why am I fucking doing this like a dipshit? I have a Sinnoh on my back. Oh my god. I am not joking. I full on forgot I had a Sinnoh. I went full on like do 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 do. Hey guys, before we get into this video, I just want to say first off, thank you so much for clicking on the video and that we are also on our way to a thousand subs. So if you guys are new here or have been around for a while and just haven't subbed yet, please consider subscribing as it is the best way to support my channel. And anyways, on to the video. And I am back with another episode and today we are going to go get an iguanodon, we're going to decorate the house, we're going to try and get a bunch of stuff done, but... We're going to go after that Iguanodon first so I can finish off the seeds for the farm. And all I need actually to do that is just my gun. I'll grab a spare just in case. And then I need the tranks. Let's get the die off me. I'm going to just get ready to go. So the interesting thing is, is I don't have creature finder anymore. So I actually have to go hunt for a good high level Iguanodon. So, um, I'm just trying to think of a good place that they spawn. I really don't know where they spawn. If I'm honest, I might have to look it up on the wiki. Okay, so it appears that they don't spawn in the redwoods that commonly, but they do spawn somewhat out towards, uh, in the jungles here. So wonder if we just head out here. Um, that's the flats where it says they don't spawn, isn't it? Oh, yeah, and I need a GPS. All right, let's head over here. I think this is where I want to go anyways for this. Um, I see some Fiomia. Not Fiomia. Well, there is a Fiomia. Actually, there's three. So I was correct. I do see some Fiomia, but I meant uh, Parasaurs. That's what I was originally going to say. Oh, man. I really need to start thinking before I say stuff. My lighting looks weird now that I've uh, changed my settings here. I had to go change my settings because I was having some uh, graphical issues. Or what was it? It was lag, really, was the issue. Was that the game kept lagging for some reason. And it really, really annoyed me. Where do you run it from, Parasaur? I've got stuff up here. Let's just check from the top of the mountain around. I got a feeling if we got Parasaurs around, we got Iguanodons around. That'd be just the awesome part is if that there were Iguanodons around that stuck out like a sore thumb. Ooh, we do got one. But watch it be a level 5. I was right! <laughs> watch it be a low level. Alright, I need to find a nice Iguanodon. Come on, just 150 with something that is good in health or stamina. Or health and melee, really. I guess I don't need stamina that much. I need an Iguanodon with good health and melee. Okay, so I do got one Iguanodon here that I missed coming around. Ooh, that's not bad. It's actually got some good points into all of that. And I bet we could get a decent melee and all that. What is it fighting? Is it fighting a raptor? Oh my god, it is. And that raptor is actually eating it. Oh, it ate the raptor. Okay. Huh. Did I bring my grapple hook? No. Good thinking, genius. Ah, the one time I need my grapple hook and I don't bring it. You know what I can do? I can lob a shot. Could I? Yeah, I could. I could definitely do this. Reload. Okay. Is he still chasing? He should still be chasing. Now what we want to do is land up here. Let me get to the other side of the bird, please. 
Got him again. Okay. Come on, buddy. Come this way. Why the fuck are you running? Oh, of course. As soon as I get off my pedestal, you come running. Oh, I don't want you to get eaten by raptors, though. Ah! Why am I fucking doing this like a dipshit? I have a Sinnoh on my back. Oh my god. I am not joking. I full on forgot I had a Sinnoh. I went full on like do 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 and get just uh, I forgot I had a Sinnoh. I full on forgot I had a cinema crops. I am not joking. Oh, and there's a reason why. I think we got the intro there. <laughs> we definitely got the intro there. Oh, you're going to pass out in the water. Fuck my ass. As long as I don't hit you again. Problem is, is now you're down here by two velociraptors. That are gonna wreck your shit. Okay. Now. I have a situation I have to solve. And which is gonna insist with violence. Against raptors. These things have honestly started to make me mad. And you know what? One thing I wish that they... I'm actually kind of glad that they're in... I don't think wild raptors can pounce on you anymore. Watch them be eating my damn... No, they're not. Oh, yeah. I need to get my spikes crafted up. Come on. You are getting eaten. I need a level. Do, 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 do. No! He's heading for him! <laughs> okay, I need to solve this problem very quick. No, 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 that is as good as I can get him, unfortunately. Um, I do believe that Sanguine Elixirs repair their taming efficiency, but I don't have one, <laughs> so I'm mad. That raptor got one hit off on him, and it's just because I gave up so I could try and lure him away, but I bro- Yeah, he changed. He changed his aggro on me. And now I have a bad word that starts with C that I have to beep out. <laughs> Okay, we're back at base. Let's get the Iguanodon out. So, starters, let's give you a bomb and la bomb and thank you. And well, bam and well, bam. And now all we need is some of this, and we'll just plant these up. Good. Stem berries. Narco berries. Alright. So that would be actually all the berries growing now. Um, This is going to be the special crops. So I ran out of the rock carrots I had from Fenyordor when we went over there. Um, Yeah. I think I have one simple kibble left. And I'm not even sure if I picked it up out of your inventory. Oh, uh, never mind. I don't got any simple kibble left. I left it on the ground. Like a genius. God dang it. I keep on doing that. You would think by now I'd remember to pick up my kibble. 
Also, I didn't look at her stats, but the stamina did turn out good, which is the one that we're not looking for anymore. <laughs> Alright, we got her saddled up, and now we're getting some seeds. We're actually getting all the ones that we need. Bring it, Turbird! Oh, yeah. This guy's meant to defend my farm now. Yeah, he's gonna count somewhat used to defend the farm as well. So... That's actually awesome now. Alright, let's get the seeds we need. Rock carrots. Long grass. Is that all we got? So far is long grass and rock carrot? Okay, we need more seeds. I thought we were getting a lot more. Savory. Alright, that's one more of the... You know what, though? All our herbivores are going to be well fed here for a little bit. I'm not getting any, like, special seeds at all. Am I? I've only gotten you, some Savru. Okay, so I got long grass, Savru, rock carrot. Now I need the... What is it? It's the citrus plant. I need the citrus fruit. I've got it. I got citronol seed. Bloop. Okay, let's get this all up there. There's actually quite a bit of berries. I know I have my own farm now. But this is quite a bit. Okay, let's pack you up. We're gonna get blindsided by a terror bird right as I do this. Or worse, a thylo. And we made it up safely. Welcome back out, my man. And we will get these plants planted. So, boom. Boom. I'm hoping that these turn out okay. Alright, that's all out. Now we need some fertilizer. Okay, that should be it. And ta-da! That would be all them planted. Okay. This is long grass, rock seed, citronol, and savru. Okay. Those are all good and going. Are you guys fully grown? You guys are already fully grown. And producing me some narco berries and stem berries. Nice. All right. Let's actually take out all the berries and go in and plant them. But, ooh, I just got myself turned around. They're so bad. Oh, let's go throw them in the preserving bit, or the feeding trough. Yeah, these guys are eating them up. You know what, though? At least now that I can't eat them all. Can I put mushrooms in there? I can't. What's going on, guys? Who's making the chirping? You know what we need? We need more lights. Luckily, I had planned on this. So, let's put one if I can. Boom. Oh, that helps so much. So, so, so much. Okay, and you know what? Let's do this in here. Um, We only need one light in here. Let's do it here. And we'll do one outside here on the terror bird pen. Okay. And you, my guys, are gonna get two torches. And I think what we're gonna do is, you know what? Right there. And you would be that one across. So, right there. Okay. Those should both light up soon. Nice. What did I do in the raptor pen for a torch? Did I just put it above the door? It's just above the door. So we'll do the same over here for the 
Dinoticus pen. Boom. And wow, that actually looks a lot better when it's all lit up, I ain't gonna lie. It's just so much brighter. I might do... You know what? Just because I've been thinking about it, and I think I can make it look awesome. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here, just because I think it would look nice, is we're gonna enclose the beehives. So, we're gonna start on this end. Perfect. I'd like to actually see where our end is. So, boom and boom. Okay, now we'll do glass walls like so. And then I wonder actually how we should do this. Because. Hmm. You know what? I could, can I pick this up? Damn it. I'd have to. I can pick you up. Because you're a bee. Okay. Yeah. I can pick you up. And move you just fine. Because you're an actual bee. These other two are S plus beehives. Which are. I guess like solid once you place them. Is that good? That is good. Can I reach that one still? I can. Okay, as long as I can reach it, we're good. So, boom, and I can't put my honey back in there, can I? Can I put it in you? No. Can I eat it? Yes. I just ate an entire thing of honey. Oh my god. I'm gonna get diabetes. Alright, so we're going with plan B because I can, because I think I have enough money for it. 27. 25. Alright, I got enough honey for this idea. So, I'm going to need some foundations. Alright, so, for what we're about to do, it's going to require a somewhat old pillar trick in arc. So, what we're going to do, we're just going to move the stuff over to this section. I thought about doing it over here. You know what? We actually... I can. Uh, I, I don't want that to spoil on me, though. I could try and do it there. Or, I, you know what? Let's just try it here. So, what I'm going to do here is, first off, I'm going to want to line... Where's my pillar? Why is it snapping all the way down there? I don't want it. So, like, are you trying to tell me I can't do this here for some reason? Huh? Oh, it won't let me. Why? Oh, it's because there's structures. And it's the S plus snapping. So I gotta do it... This way. That's not straight. Okay. Let's do it over here. Because I want this one. You know, why don't I just do this? Okay, and then I need my pillar there. And then, boom, I can pick you up. And now... Is that the right distance? Yeah, that is the right distance. Okay. So, what I'm going to start doing here is I'm going to start lowering the pillars. Okay. And what that's going to do is it's going to slowly lower the foundation. Okay. One more should do it. Boom. Pick up a bomb. Oh, uh, that actually went to the wrong place. Boom. So we need it. Okay, yeah, that. Pick up that. Pick up you. 
And now this is where something a little, little complicated happens. And I actually completely figured it out. Oh, got it completely figured out. All right, I promise. All right. So we do that. Pick you up. And then we need to move this back again. Boom. All right. Now he's Gucci. And we got our foundation down. All right. And that is per should be like square on with where I want it. All right. That should be square on. Actually, I think I should try and move it back further. All right. We got time here to pick up all this still. So don't worry about that. Okay. So what I need to do is boom. Because I got to work here with the time. Actually, I can't work there with the time. I don't got the time. Let's just do it this way, but I got to lower these. So, I gotta lower that. You guys probably don't want to see this again. So we're just going to skip past. There's my lowering point. Okay. Now we are good to put up the... Um, what is it here? The greenhouse glass. You know what? Seems how I did make one more. Let's just demolish that. I don't think we're going to need the extra. Okay, we're good. Boom, and boom. Okay, so we could make that. You know what? We can make that too high. i got to go get more. Dang it. I shouldn't have destroyed that and just gone back. Ah! Okay, so I've gotten my beehives. Now let's get final walls up. Okay. Boom, that's nice. I think definitely upgrading the beehive area was a smart idea for this episode. Because it's just going to help us make more room. So, I got that one. Then I got my two domesticated ones. So, let's place down... Oh, I can't place you down. Uh-oh. You know what, then? I can't place you down. Might have to. Huh. Yeah, because you got to go on solid ground, don't you? I can't have you. Ooh. But these guys can. Which is nice. So I'm sorry, Queen Bee, but you might just get. Will you die in this state? I don't think you will. If. I don't think she will. I think we should be good with her like that. But now, let's go put the roof on it. And the railing is done. Um, we will put a light. You know what? We'll put a light. Why am I over encumbered now? What is on me that is so heavy? Don't need you. I got 38 pounds worth of uh, flowers. Okay. And you know what? I got a level. So you know what? Let's put it in weight. I felt so sluggish. I'm feeling so much better now, though. You know what? Let's check on our crops. Let's see how they're doing. Oh, yeah. They're doing so much better. What, are you the citronol? You are. Okay, you're producing five. All right. Yeah, we're going to definitely be banking out some kibble now. You know what I need to get working on? Like, uh, it was industrial cooking pot. So that way I can make all that stuff. Okay. Let's get the roofs up. Do, 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 do. Nah. Alrighty. And put up the railing. I think we only need railing on the front part, don't we? Yeah. Uh, let's demolish that. Because I got an idea for some stuff around here in the middle. Because we might do an area for the beer keg. 
but we might also do an area for a cooking pot and some other stuff. So, uh, might I even have like a Hesponorinus shelf put up. I'll work. Like, again, this, this farm is going to be constantly expanding. I mean, this was something that wasn't necessarily needed, but I actually do like it, so... We will split the, was it the flowers, and we'll give you one, and we'll give you one, and I don't think that's going to contain the bees, yeah, because look, the, they get out, but I don't think we should get stung around it at all, so I think we should be fine. Is this brewing beer? Oh yeah, we got two beer going so far, that's awesome, I'm glad, I'm so glad that I got this going so early, because it's just pumping it out. But again, we might be redoing that as well. So, I don't know. That might just be something that we have to see in the next episode.